think because so much goes into these performances, you know, and this is Jingle Bell Ball is massive. It's such a, and it was always a big thing for us when I was in the group as well. So to be doing that on my own is wild to me. As I got to the arena, that's when I started getting nervous. I was like, oh, I'm back. But um, no, it just, it just feels good to be here and I just, I can't wait. There's definitely, it's excited energy for sure. Soundcheck went really well, it was, it was really good. So yeah, it's given me that kind of like, yeah, this is gonna be a good one. I feel good. Back, whack, whack, up first. I know, it's, it's oh. weird. It's like you just go whack. We had like some hours to spare. There's me thinking I was gonna go and sleep or nap. We ended up making TikToks, didn't we? Of course we did. Um, <laughs> but yeah, no, that was fun. Um, so yeah, content. Um, trying to rest my voice, lots of honey tea, and just chilling out really. Um, just using that time to kind of just breathe. We are starting glam, jingle bell ball. We're gonna do a nice warm look. Um, <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna do something not too crazy. I feel like my outfit is saying a lot. It's saying a lot. Yeah, so yeah, we're gonna keep it nice and Nice and clean. So I decided to bring a bit of jingle to the ball, as you can see. Um, I'm wearing Isabel Moron. I went for my braids, my staple. Final touches. We are on our way. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Glam ready. Going for press. And then it's performance, baby. Oh. Alicia Keys knows who I am, I think, anyway. I looked at her and she said, um, oh, hey, baby, and I went, oh. As an artist, I don't know, sometimes you think like we are just like normal people, but Alicia Keys is like up there, do you know what I mean? Like she's a legend, so yeah, wow. I'm gonna knock on Leanne's dressing room. Hopefully she's, uh, she's decent. Leanne, are you all right? We got five minutes. Hi there, I know you're about to go on stage, but can I have a quick chat with you on the way? Of course I can. Okay. So then I did a bit of press, did some pictures, some interviews. Well, you def definitely don't get used to all the pictures and paps. Like, I just, I don't think you can ever, yeah, get used to that. I don't know what it is. It's just a very, like, intense thing, isn't it, really? Like, people shouting and lots of flashing lights. Like, that's not a normal situation, you know? It's, yeah, it's definitely a lot. So now I'm just gonna try and relax. Um, I'm gonna do more vocal warm-ups. Um, and I, my assistant choreographer keeps, like she does like breathing techniques and she's gonna just make me feel grounded and present and yeah, just get me ready for the show. I feel like the nerves, nerves are nerves, you know? Like I think we used to get them as a group as well. Cause you just rehearse so much and like you put so much into it, you just want it to go well, you know, and, and, it, and it always does and it always will. I like think the main thing for me and that I've always kept into myself is just enjoy it. I feel like we have like a little family, like we're just kind of, I don't know, like we, it doesn't feel like work when we're together. It just feels like we're all just hanging out and having fun. Leah. Do you know what, if I see some of my fans that literally come to everything, then I'd be like, I'm, well, I already know like, with the Capital fans and the Capital audience, like I feel like I'm at home anyway. Um, so as soon as I, I see ones that I know, I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm good. And then I'll just have fun. What an incredible way to end the year. I mean, it's been, it's been a ride and to be able to end it with that performance, it's just incredible. So bye Capital. Bye Capital Radio, we love you. Mwah, see you soon! Nice Mwah. Good night! Woo -woo. <laughs>